Teresa, thank you. Developing story out of New London as investigators plan to return to a shoreline park this morning after six children were hurt. They are trying to figure out how the children were shocked at an amusement park ride. It happened Tuesday afternoon at Ocean Beach Park, which is near Neptune Avenue in New London. News 8's Kent Pierce live there this morning with where the investigation currently stands. Good morning, Kent. Good morning, Laura and Keith. Ocean Beach is one of those old fashioned shoreline amusement parks. Not many of them left. But if you talk to some of the people out here on the beach, as News 8 did yesterday, they'll say the emphasis for the rides, at least, is on the old part. Now, this happened on the Scrambler ride. It's a ride that spins and twirls at the same time. It's supposed to be exciting, but not shocking. Not in this way, at least. Six kids felt an electrical tingling as they got off the Scrambler around two yesterday afternoon. One child touched the fence the metal railing part surrounding the ride and got some electrical burns on his hands. All six kids were taken to Lawrence and Memorial Hospital, which fortunately is just a little bit up the road here. They were treated and released. The rides were all shut down and the investigation began. Meanwhile, at least one father on the beach said he doesn't trust the rides because of their age. It's kind of scary to hear those things and I'm concerned for my daughter. I'm never going to go there until they fix it. They do something about those rides. Now, you may remember the manager of the park from when we were out here for News 8's Beach Week back in May. He's been working here since he was a teenager. Well, he released a statement saying safety is their number one priority and they will keep working with investigators. The state police fire marshal's office has the real experts in amusement park ride safety. They were out here for yester yesterday for several hours. Now, if you take a look out here live, that is the scrambler right back there. And uh, what happened is that yesterday there was a soaking rain. We're told that the power running all these rides goes underground. So that is certainly something they're looking into, whether the combination of the soaking wet ground and the underground power lines had anything to do with this. But we're expecting investigators, local and state, to be back out here later on this morning. We're live at Ocean Beach in New Haven, in New London. I'm Kent Pierce. Back to you.